Okay guys, here's just a quick demo of the the eye breath eye breathalyzer uh, utilizing the wondrous NXP Hexaware, one modified alcohol clickboard, one what's that? Docking station, brilliant. And in here, if I just show you, is just any old generic USB power bar. And that sits nicely in the beer head. Okay. So, quick demo of how it works. There we are, as it stands. Let's get this lined up. Lovely. Right, so we've got that. Nothing is complete without a lid. So we'll just pop the lid on. Not before we turn it on, of course. Ta da And on goes the lid. Wonderful. Now, you can see flickering here. I cannot see flickering on here no there you know what i mean anyway so it's flickering it's all to do with refresh rates this one is refreshing faster than that one and you're getting the a-listing and all that horrible stuff just ignore that it's not flickering in real life it's just one of those things it's an oled it's using you know slow serial to load itself anyway there we go so uh so this is the first screen and the initial test i will be doing sans this so this is I wanted vodka, it's actually Bacardi, but you know, forgive me for that, it's still 40% alcohol, so happy days. Um, so, effectively, we'll just run through all the controls. The two bottom buttons here will turn on and off the Bluetooth, so that's useful. And then the only other control you've got is a start here. This guy up here is the calibration screw. Um, I am gonna give a caveat right now I have done some fairly thumb in the air rudimentary calculations. I have no way of actually calibrating this thing, so please, 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 don't take this as re you know as as read. I will not be held responsible for any loss of driver's licenses, underwear, teeth, or dignity. Excellent. Right. So to begin the test, what it's going to do is it'll initialize first. After the initialization, it then does the test. And then it does the comparison and spits back a parts per million value of alcohol that is detected on your system. And then depending on the range of where that sits, it will tell you whether you are sober, had a drink, drunk, or heading for a hangover. Um, so let's just run through the sequence now. So press start here on touch screen. So it says initializing, gives you some haptic feedback to let you know what's going on. This is where it would expect you to blow and of course the PPM is very, very low, so it's got a little smiley face now saying sober as a judge. So that's excellent news. So, next step will be not to do it with alcohol yet. I'm going to show you something much cooler. Okay, so what's going on on here? Well, clonk, this is my iPhone. And I have created a custom build of the Hexaware app to include a rather spanky logo, which is a little beer bottle thing, which I will uh, bring a, I know, I'll, I'll put something on the video, which is gonna ping up sort of somewhere up here. Lovely. So if you click on that, and you can see here it says eye breath breathalyzer, click. And here it's gonna pick up the last value that was pinged out by the Bluetooth which in this case, it's five parts per million, which is incredibly low and is just some ambient atmospheric value. Once it's pinged that, it then pings that to the VolkSense cloud, and you can then create some rather spanky looking graphs. I have fudged this a bit. So this is in fact the, uh, the pressure um, uh, Bluetooth. This, is the uh, pressure UUID, um, just because they've all been assigned for the uh, for the device. Um, and uh, there was no other way of doing it without sort of rewriting some firmware and all that sort of stuff. So it's a bit hacky, but it works. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to get the VolkSense thing to see um, my spanky beer logo, which I did here. Um, so what it's actually doing is I ping the data to my eye breath um, sensor and I also just send a copy to uh, the pressure one as well and then what that does 
is then the pressure one will always be read by volt sense and you just have to label up the sensor as you see fit. Excellent. Right, so that's just a quick rundown. Exciting times. Next step will be with some booze. Okay, so as you can see, this uh, has gone down a little bit now. So we're gonna have a go with our tester and see what values we can start to uh, return. So here we go. Initializing, doing the test, bit of haptic feedback. And I've got a little bit of a little bit more alcohol in my system. So that's lovely. Okay, now as you can see, this is now not as full as it was. That was the Cardi. Anyway, so let's do the test now. I'll just turn on my phone and we'll show up what the uh, eye breath uh, sensor is going to pick up. So here we go, it's initializing. Bit of haptic to let me know it's nearly done. And as you can see now, I'm reading a respectable 109 ppm, and it's telling me, do you know what? I've had a drink. Good times. <laughs> 